Welcome back to Jetline Marvel for another thrilling episode. In this video, we'll look at 10 fascinating facts about the sixth generation fighter plane that the UK, Japan, and Italy are working to develop. Number 1. The UK has revealed plans to produce the sixth generation fighter jet in cooperation with Japan and Italy with a shared ambition to develop a next-generation fighter aircraft as part of a new global combat air program. It is a more lethal combat jet now that the UK and Japan have finished developing cutting-edge technology. Number 2. The program is being developed closely in conjunction with the BAE system, which offers an electronic system, the MBDA, which offers next-generation armaments, and Rolls-Royce, which is producing the aircraft's engines. A number of next-generation future combat air system capabilities are currently being evaluated and developed by the UK under the Tempest program, which is already in the development phase of the sixth-generation fighter jet. Number 3. Global Combat Air Program This aircraft will operate under the crew and uncrewed system that can be operated under the closed network group, just like every other sixth-generation fighter. Loyal wingman platforms will be a part of a micro-air group in a system of systems strategy. Number 4. The FCAS program is being created by the Airbus team, with assistance from France, Germany, and Spain, as the European Union declared, in order to compete with the Global Combat Air Program, which is being developed under the guidance of the United Kingdom. Although the two fighter jets will share certain similarities, they will have different qualities. The UK will profit financially from this investment in aircraft development and pick up new capabilities for building planes. Number 5. Japan has already developed and built a number of demonstration aircraft. The first experimental stealth technology demonstration for the sixth generation of aircraft is the Mitsubishi Heavy Industries built X2. This aircraft is used to learn stealth technology and prototypes. The X2 successfully completed its first flight on April 22, 2016, flying from Nagoya Airfield to the JASDF's Gifu Airfield. Number 6. Japan Developed Aircraft's Engine Nozzle which includes 3D thrust vectoring similar to the system used on the Rockwell X-31, is being added by Japan. This allows for quick aircraft movement and supports a variety of flight trajectories. Additionally, thanks to the display of fly-by optics, a capability unique to this aircraft, the data are processed 100 times faster than with wires. Due to its immunity to electromagnetic interference, it has benefited in Warzone. Number 7. Additionally Japan adding this aircraft also has the capacity to repair its own flight controls, enabling it to detect flaws or damage to its flight control surface on its own. Maintain, adjust, and carry out controlled flight. It will have a radar system that is comparable to the F-35s. Japan has conducted research on the airframe construction of its aircraft, eliminating fasteners and replacing them with solid adhesive bonding. Additionally, its surface will have a special covering that can lessen radar reflection. Number 8, a microwave weapon will also be placed on the Tempest by Japan in order to deflect incoming missiles. This aircraft has a drone control system that interacts with the Boeing Wingman drone control system. When compared to using drones, which can be fired from an aircraft's weapons bay to reach and target the enemy at a great distance, this will be a breakthrough in operating a greater range. Number 9. How the UK benefited from the initiative. It will gain knowledge of the creation of airplanes, as well as rights to patents on the technology, which may potentially lead to the development of other products. It will also create 21,000 jobs in the next 10 years and strengthen the economic reform of exporting such goods. As part of the agreement, the bulk of aircraft will be developed in the United Kingdom. Number 10. The addition of Japan will also increase economies of scale, as its own FX-6 generation fighter program was intended to replace about 90 F-2 planes starting in the mid-2030s. With the potential for up to 100 aircraft, the UK has long been aiming to replace its Eurofighter Typhoon FGR-4 platform 
with what is now the GCAP starting in the middle of the 2030s. The GCAP will also take the place of Italy's Eurofighters. Thank you for watching the video. Please share your thoughts on the 6th generation Tempest fighter jet in the comments. Please subscribe to our channel if you are a new viewer.